guys welcome back to another video and uh, yes i am doing the video with wet hair i washed my hair about half an hour ago i was trying some new samples of products that i got and i will share that with you guys in another video but today as you can see from the title below i'll be talking about the dr brander's peppermint soap and the tea tree soap originally i had bought a combination of the peppermint the tea tree and the almond and um i am a lover of almond anything in almond oil or almond i love it but to my surprise i wasn't really feeling the almond scented one but i have been loving 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 the tea tree and the peppermint i have used the peppermint one before um this is not my first time using the peppermint one but i only had done it in a blog post i didn't do it in a video so today i'll be sharing with you guys my thoughts on both products i don't know if you guys can see that hopefully you guys can see that let me try and zoom this one in so this is the tea tree one and then this is the the peppermint one I know um, okay which one to talk about first how about we play any mini money <laughs> okay no we're not gonna play that game all right I'm just gonna go with the peppermint scene as I've used this before um, as you guys know dr. Bronner's is an 18 and one um, pure Castile soap and ingredients it contains like coconut oil organic palm kernel oil organic olive oil um it has mesa arvenis which is um menthol something like menthol for the peppermint and um organic hemp oil organic jojoba oil mensa piperita um it has citric acid and it has tocopherol if that's how it's pronounced i'm not so sure about that um so yeah, this is a multi-purpose as you guys can see. I've used a quarter of the bottle so far. Um, this can be used to wash your hair, can be used to wash your body, can be used to wash clothes, can be used to scrub your bathroom, can be used to scrub your sink. This is a multi-purpose organic soap. I've used it to wash my hair, I've used it to wash my body. That's about what I use it for um, since using this. And as I said, guys, this is not my first time using the peppermint one, and I love it. Oh, you guys know how peppermint smell. Um, I just love the aroma it gives off when you shower and that feeling is special because it's summertime now and um, it's very hot when you shower with this. The peppermint feeling leaves you feeling so fresh and so cool, and especially when it's bedtime. Um, however, to me, this soap, it, well, a body wash, I should say, um, it works wonders for my skin. I don't know about your struggle with eczema. I developed eczema in my since I started my 20s, I don't, I don't know what happened, but my skin decided to, you know what, I'm gonna give you eczema, okay, cool, welcome. <laughs> and um, since using this soap, I've realized that I had a flare-up, last week I had a flare-up, um, it was right on my neck area, I still have a bit on my chest, I try not to wear my chest out, um, because um, my skin looks like, it looks like you, I don't know if you get a burn and it, it you know that it, it's healing and it kind of has the, 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 the kind of scab over it. That That's how my eczema looks, but on my neck, it only looks like just a dark rash on my neck, um, my neck area. Um, I realized that using this, it has helped so much and I realized it has been helping with my chest. Um, I, have these small little bumps in my chest i realize it's been helping and i know i've talked about um tinea first eye color in the past on this video and 
yeah I told you guys that this peppermint soap also helps it and next I'm gonna put down the peppermint and let's get to the tea tree because trust me guys it has also helped me when it comes to the tenuous eye colors that if you guys anybody struggle you guys have these maybe white patches or darker patches on your skin and you're wondering what it is and really and truly you know that you don't struggle with liver spots it's pitera it's another name another name for tenuous eye color is pityriasis so that's another name for it if you're not familiar with the name i just said before so if you struggle with pityriasis these products are good for you to use um, the tea tree has not only helped my body but it has helped my face a lot I've been breaking out terribly since the new year has started and for the life of me nothing I do is getting rid of it but I know what's happening so I know I'm not gonna get rid of it so quickly but it really annoys me especially knowing that it's summertime and I have to be putting on makeup to go outside and it really annoys me but this tea tree soap has helped me a lot I use it in I use it at night time and sometimes I use it in the mornings I use it to also wash my makeup off this removes my makeup so well you guys when I say it removes every single thing it removes every single thing and you don't have to worry about washing in your hairline because this as I said is an organic soap and a little goes a long way when i say a little i mean you can just add a dollop of that i don't know if you guys can see that that's like two drops and wet your hand and set it up and that's about it to wash your face you need no more that's how that's how much this product suds and i really love them both and if you have never tried these products before i highly recommend you give them a try um what i want to try next is the citrus one because um i've read reviews and watched youtube videos on the citrus one that it helps to get rid of dark marks so i want to try that one next so if you have tried the citrus one and you've loved it leave a comment down below letting me know if you you've loved it or leave a comment down below if you've ever tried these products and also give a thumbs up for dr runners i love their products i've been using their products for years and they've never failed me before and i will always continue to use their products and these are just the eight ounce bottles so if you've never tried it before and you want to try their product they have a small one about this size i'm not sure how much ounce i think it's a one ounce i think don't quote me on that they also have soap bar soaps they don't only sell soaps and body washes they also sell shaving creams they sell toothpaste they sell body products body lotions and they have it all in every scent that they carry the body washes in so go check their site out you can also find their products on amazon ebay um in drug local drugstores wherever you live i live in jamaica so you can get it in the health food stores here but what i did i had ordered them directly from dr bronner's um it took a little while to get here seen as i ordered from them and i was going through a shipping company in which i use Korea J ja for my shipping when it comes to um, shipping products from the us to jamaica these two products amazing 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 i want to try the rest of the line of products as i said guys i'm not really a fan of the almond one but if you try it and you like it kudos to you but i'm a lover of almond and it wasn't really my thing but the teacher and the peppermint so far have been my savers my life savers and as i said guys a little goes a long way and all i have to say is these products are amazing it's a must try i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and tell everybody you know and yes guys i will do my best to try to putting out more content and putting out more inspirational videos or story times and if there is a specific video that you guys would like me to post, do let me know. 
So I hope you have a wonderful day guys. Bye.